What is up, everybody, and welcome back to the Mid-Level Media channel, your hub for everything physical media and entertainment. And I've got some fresh packages uh, from MVD, so you know what that means. I've got my new Arrow Video Haul uh, for the month of May, and I'm very excited um, about the titles that are coming out this month and what I'm getting. I actually forgot about some of them, except for like the one main one. Um, but yeah, oh my goodness, I feel steel. That rhymed. I feel steel in this package. Oh my goodness, I, I finally got it. Um, I finally got it. So this is not a May release. Hopefully the next package is. Again, I haven't opened these yet. Uh, so this is not a May release. This is an April release, but I never got this and I was supposed to. And that is the RoboCop 4K Steelbook. Look at that thing, it's absolutely gorgeous. I'll zoom in on you know everything if you guys want to read it. Again, I've already done a review for this on the channel. You can go check it out. I'll link it down below and all that stuff. Um, but I'm so happy to have this steelbook. Again, I have that big box set, but the steelbook's awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and unbox it for you guys because I have it in my possession. And let's see. Let's get into it. Hopefully, these are the May titles that I've been waiting for. Um, there's one in particular I'm just very excited about. Um, okay. Ooh, I forgot that this one was this month. Um, okay. Yeah, we got, we got some good stuff in here, guys. We got some good stuff. So I finally have it. I have wild things. I have wild things on 4k. Very excited about this one to finally watch it. And because this packaging is so nice, like this is beautiful. Look at this. Definitely one of the coolest, uh, most awesome box sets that I've ever seen Arrow video do. Like the this artwork is absolutely stellar. Again, there's steel books for this. There's like a steel book Zavi, uh, box set as well. Um, but I'm happy with the box set. I, I love this version. So yeah, again, I don't know why I'm showing you all the angles. We're going to do the official unboxing at the table here in a second, but wild things I'm very excited for it to watch in 4k. Very excited. Again, I've only seen parts of it. You guys can probably guess which parts I've seen. Um, but I also got girls night out. Very cool release. Um, I'm excited to watch this. A lot of people said this is a horrible movie. Um, but it has to be seen to believe and I'm going to watch this and I might just might, depending on how much I like it, do a standalone review for it. So, um, yeah, there's like a bear coming through the window. Oh, look guys, I, I'm showing you all the details, but we're going to go to the table. We're going to do the full unboxing and all these amazing arrow releases. Let's go. All right. So we're over here at the unboxing table and we're going to do this in order of release date. So this one came out, uh, I forget the exact date in April, but again, it's already available. Hopefully their steel books are still available uh, to purchase, but I will find it and link it down below. Um, but yeah, you might have to get on the arrow site. I don't know if these are still on Amazon or not, um, but hopefully there's plenty available for these. This is a gorgeous steel book. Again, I haven't been the biggest fan of Arrow video. Um, and their steel books sometimes, but like when you have an iconic poster like RoboCop, it uh, it works. And this is absolutely gorgeous steel book. I'm glad I own two versions um, of this 4K now. And yeah, we'll look at the back, and you know this has the 4K Ultra HD, um, you know, uh, edition. It has the director's cut, and it also has the theatrical cut in it. And we'll zoom in on the casting list and the specs and all that stuff again i covered all of this in my review of this movie you can go check that out look at the back oh my goodness that back is incredible i love the back delta city has a uh the future has a silver lining that is awesome i love that it has like kind of like the fantasy um you know background as well for detroit so i i love this you got the mgm at the bottom so freaking awesome Let's crack this sucker open. You got the same disc right here. Got a little booklet on the inside. Again, you get a much bigger booklet if you get that box set release, which I highly recommend if those are still available to get. Let's kind of flip through there. That's really cool. You got, you know, the model for RoboCop right there. You got some really cool stuff. Some of the stunt, the stunt work in this film. Image of Peter Weller. Yeah, cool stuff. I mean, these booklets are always nice additions. And we'll take these discs out. And again, like I said, you got the theatrical cut, you got the director's cut. Um, the difference is you get a little bit more violence in that director's cut. And I cannot get this disc out. Again, I don't want to, I know I already own a disc, but I still don't want to scratch that. Okay, so very cool. It's the guy that's getting blown away by the, uh, by the mech droid in the office setting. That's freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. Okay, put the disc back in. Again, I know you've, 
probably already seen this on various other channels, but you're going to see it again right here with me. But just beautiful, stunning steel book. It is a glossy finish. Um, it kind of feels, again, like a combination of glossy and matte. Because down here it feels kind of matte, and then right here it kind of like fades back and forth because the actual font feels matte as well. So really cool how they did this steel book. I dig it. All right, so we're going to save the, uh, you know, the, the, the big one for last. We're going to do Girls Night Out. So we're also going in order of release date. So this is due out on May the 17th. Again, I will be leaving the link for purchase in the description below. So May the 17th when this one comes out. So this upcoming week. And yeah, let's... Uh, I usually try to cut these before I do this. I did not do it this time. This looks uh, pretty fun. I'll be honest. It's probably going to be crap, but it looks pretty fun. Girls Night Out. Ooh, this is nice. That's embossed up there. The Girls Night Out. That is nice. And you also have uh, the claws from the bear. Little bear creature busting. I have no context for this film. I don't know what it's about, so don't make fun of me. Um, but yeah, you got the, the claws right there, the razor blades on the, um, coming out of the hand are embossed. That's really cool. They all went in, but only a few got out. Very cool. So look at the spine right here. The spine is also embossed, which is awesome. You got the little image of the bear up there. You got a nice little back. Again, girls night out embossed on the back. You don't really see embossing done too much on the back of a slip cover. So that is pretty cool. Um, and then I'll zoom in on the casting list, starring Hal Holbrook. Very cool stuff. Yeah, I am not familiar with this film. Again, you can read the synopsis right there to see what you're getting yourself in for. Um, and yeah, you got some images of some young ladies that are likely being terrified by by monstrous bear with with knives for claws. All right, so we got the you know the same image on the cover right here. I imagine this does have reversible cover art. We'll show it in a second. Girls Night Out, and then on the back, oh, let's get it in focus, let's get it in focus, there we go, all right, so yeah, Hal Holbrook was in Creep Show. I, I do know that, that actor, he's been in a lot of horror stuff, all right, so, got some more synopsis down here, we got the special features, it's like a good amount of special features in this, very cool, you know, obscure little 80s horror movies, I mean, Arrow Video really just excels at this. Like, I know everybody says Scream Factory is, is the best, but they don't put out titles like this. Like, Scream Factory usually stays pretty mainstream most of the time. Uh, they're not putting out titles like Girls' Night Out. So it's really cool that they restore these. You know, it, it, they could be shit uh, for sure, but it's cool that, you know, they're not lost in film history and we get to, you know, revisit them, you know, in a new, a new transfer and great special features that kind of put things into context. What they were thinking when they made it, I think that's cool. Uh, but let's see, this is the alternate artwork because there is an alternate slipcover for this edition. Uh, I think it's called The Scare Maker, but we'll flip through this book. And, oh my God, what is this? <laughs> I, can't, I can't wait to watch this movie. Oh my God, that looks that looks horribly awesome. <laughs> Horrible, but awesome. Okay, and we got more images of the bear behind a young lady right there. Uh, that guy looks like Rambo, like a generic dollar store Rambo. You got the couple on the beds. You know, there's going to be some, you know, in-bed sex shenanigans in here and here you got you know old vhs tapes so yeah very awesome i need to read this one that actually looks pretty interesting they were talking about like the history of the, the movie on home video it looks like right there so very cool and you got the uh the disc art right there we'll go ahead and flip this and this is the original poster i imagine so very cool stuff and this is all the same stuff that we just looked at and uh, yeah, I'm I'm actually really excited to check this out. And this is a really, guys, I cannot stress to you enough. This is a really nice feeling slipcover um, from Arrow Video. Again, I like that it's embossed. Girls' Night Out is embossed on all sides, which I think is awesome. So there you go. Now let's get into the main event, guys. This is Wild Things. Um, I think this movie came out in 1998. So again, I seen parts of this movie, you know, when I was a teenager and stuff. Um, you know, you guys can imagine why. I haven't seen this movie in its entirety, but when this was announced, I was so excited to get a chance to revisit it as an actual film, um, you know, and not watch it as a disgusting teenager with ulterior motives. I get to watch it as an actual film. I've heard various things about this movie. I heard some people say it's crap. I heard some people say it's a really good thriller. Um, but anyway, I'm excited to, to watch it for its actual filmmaking merits and qualities. So right there, we got the 
Uh, oh, this is from the uh, director of Henry Portrait of a Serial Killer, which I have not got yet because of the disc issue, so hopefully they fix that soon. But yeah, you got the synopsis, you got all the special features. I cannot wait to dig into these special features. And yeah, you got the cast down there. So just, just an all-star cast. You got Kevin Bacon, Matt Dillon. I mean, who doesn't love Kevin Bacon? Um, Nev Campbell, like you got, uh, you know, Denise Richards, obviously. Like just a really cool cast in this one. So again, I cannot wait to watch it. You got all the specs down below. Dolby Audio. So yeah, this looks like they, they went all out on this release. Um, and yeah, this is like, oh my goodness. It just feels, I just love, <laughs> I love this so much. It This honestly is my favorite part of being a physical media collector is getting to own and feel these new Arrow video releases every single month. These new box set releases are always so nice, so top tier. It's why Arrow video is king. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll show you the side right there. In the back, look at this. Just It's so simple. It's just like a skyline and a lake or a pond. Um, you know, a swamp with alligator eyes sticking out of the bottom. Look at that. Just the blues. It's beautiful. I mean, it is absolutely beautiful. And yeah, down there at the bottom, it says 1998. Um, so, all right, let's get this out of the box. We'll show you the inside of the box right there. So very cool. Yeah, I really dig the feeling of this. Arrow video. It's just, Arrow video just does great work. And again, I love the way it smells. I can smell it from here. I'm not even like right on top of it. Um, but really cool how they did this. I like that this is different from the regular cover. And I imagine it's going to have reversible cover art as well. Anyway, this is a nice little booklet right here. We'll flip through the booklets. And there you go. There you go. You got Neff Campbell, Denise Richards. Looking all, looking all good right there. I'll be honest. Um, you know, Denise Richards, Kevin Bacon on the bed, more Denise Richards. They are really selling this movie on Denise Richards. Look at that. <laughs> she's a, she's in every page of this booklet. Uh, and for good reason, for good reason. I wonder, look at that. Oh my goodness. Um, I wonder if there is a page. There we go. There's just some Nev Campbell love right there. Uh, Denise Richards. I'm going to flip through this and see how many pages actually have Denise Richards. Um, more Denise Richards. Kevin, or Matt Dillon's right there. Kevin Bacon, Matt Dillon. Okay, we're going we're going on a streak without Denise Richards. There's another Denise Richards shot. Um, I don't know if anybody really wants to see this, but I'm interested. And there we go. There we go. There's another good shot of both of them together. You know, Denise Richards again. So Denise Richards was in at least 25 out of 30 uh, of these pages right here. But again, like I said, for good reason. Um, this poster, I just want to frame this, to be honest. And I like the original one, too, that we're going to see here in a second. Again, I'm going to be doing a full review of this. So I'll show this poster, you know, better in that review probably. But I'm going to try to show it the best I can right here. Um, so yeah, expect a full 4K review of this film. I am definitely going to be deep diving into this one. Um, and yeah, this is the 4K case. And I don't think I said it, but this one is actually due out on May the 24th. So I'll be leaving the link down below. For you guys to purchase, but again, it's not out as of right now. It's still about, uh, you know, a week and a half away. So down here, we got the specs and all this stuff. I'm showing all the same stuff again, but again, um, I want to give you all the full tour. Your money's worth. So you just get a 4K disc in this one, which again, I'm fine with. I'm fine with it. The price will flex it, but I actually think that this one is more expensive than RoboCop, though. I think this one's going for $42. Um, so there better be some good special features in here. Edgar Allan Poe Horror. That's cool. Kevin Bacon. We got some cool cards right here. Neff Campbell. That's a really nice card of Denise Richards. Uh, another one, Denise Richards. So yeah, there you go. There you go. But yeah, I, again, if this is $42.99, hopefully they lower the price a little bit. I, I expect that we'll probably see this in Best Buy because we have been seeing the Aero Video uh, box set releases in Best Buy, but there you go, guys. Um, oh, I forgot to do the reversible cover. I wonder if it's the original poster. Yes, it is. That is awesome. I do. I like that. I like that touch. So, um, look, I'm excited. I, I'm excited to dig into this, to watch this. So, I, I think I'm going to go do it right now. But I appreciate you guys watching. Um, I guess I should, you know, box this stuff up. But appreciate you guys watching. You know, again, I'll be leaving the links for purchase down below. While things will be out on um, May the 24th and you got girls night out due out on May the 17th and RoboCop is already available. So I'll be leaving all the links down below for purchase. Please subscribe to this channel. If this is your first time discovering me, also hit the like button and comment down below guys, which one of these are you interested in? 
um, you know, which movie is your favorite. Let me know in that comment section below. Also, be sure to turn on those bell notifications for all future videos and follow me on all my social media accounts. Those links are in the description. And we'll see you next time.